Welcome to New Hampshire, folks, for what is sure to be another heart-pounding NHRA event. This is New England Dragway, home to the NHRA New England Nationals, and boy, do we have a great race day ahead of you today. This is the showdown we have been waiting to see. Another sensational race is in the books, and we've got more to come, so don't go anywhere. line and in the end that was all they needed to bring home the victory. In case you're looking to go on a road trip, the NHRA has over 140 sanctioned drag strips across America. Both drivers have their work cut out for them in this next race. The right lane driver makes a strong getaway off the line, and that was all she wrote.
The sun is shining, the fans are out in full force, and you can just feel the anticipation in the air. That's right, all the NHRA action is about to get underway, so find your seats and get ready to cheer. Don't miss this one, folks. The right lane driver makes a strong getaway off the line, and that was all she wrote. founder Wally Parks began the NHRA in 1951 to promote a safe, competitive organization for hot rod drag racing. Over 25,000 people signed up in the first year alone. Stay tuned for this one, folks. It should be a blast. Go anywhere. We've still got the finals to come where the Wally will be awarded to a very deserving driver this weekend. That was all they needed to bring home the victory.
The NHRA, that's the National Hot Rod Association, is the largest auto racing sanctioning body in the world. There are over 35,000 licensed competitors. The talent rolls up in the starting line in the right lane for our next race. time advantage, but it was exactly what they needed to come out ahead for the win. Staying hydrated out there, folks. Louisiana's favorite son, Richie Stevens Jr., is rolling up to the starting line now. You can't teach the sort of speed that this competitor has, so let's see if that translates into a race win here today. just keeps delivering, doesn't it? On behalf of everybody here in the announcing booth, thanks for coming out. We hope to see you at the next NHRA Camping World Series event. Still waiting to hear from the pits about what exactly went wrong with this pass. Ultimately, though, it didn't seem to matter too much. They did manage to bring their car over the finish line first. Okay. 